Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT. Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Yo. So, I don't know if you heard about Alabama's basketball program, college. Uh, there, there was a guy. The Sooners? No, they're the Crimson Tide. That's what I meant. So, there's a guy who plays for their team. I think he's like like a star freshman sort of player. Like, really good like college player. Bama! Bama! Um... So what happened was he went to an, a thing, a bar, a thing with a friend. <laughs> a bar thing. Okay. Uh, he went to a club, most likely. Or some event or something. Okay. He. An event. Brought the gun. He brought a gun. Gotcha. Gave it to his friend. Gave the his gun. His friend shot a girl in the head and killed her. Not his So fault. essentially like. He provided the murder weapon, but he, didn't pull wait, the trigger. What the fuck? What are you talking about? What? What? <laughs> so the, it was a murder weapon when it was in his pocket. If he would have not brought the gun, was there would have a, never been a murder. Your that, honor, and, and that's and that's okay. Your honor was the gun a murder weapon when it was in my client's pocket. You're right. No wrong. Okay. Anyways. Then. Okay. So, then. so anyways, neither here nor there. I think I think he's he, like you know the whole thing was like. Is he responsible at all? I think that, I think he didn't end up getting charged or anything, right? Oh, so, you shouldn't be. So it's the South. Everybody has a gun. <laughs> I guess in Alabama, <laughs> bang bang, Texas uh, for sure. So he comes out for war- for you know team announcements at an Alabama game. Sure, he walks out onto the onto the floor of the crowd, <laughs> yeah, and, okay. and one of his teammates. Pats him down like he's at TSA. Oh, that's a, wait a minute, wait. That should have been. A, <laughs> you should have. No, oh, they say you gotta save that for when you score a touchdown. You gotta save that for when you score a touchdown. Now, that's I've heard. Funny. I don't know. I've heard that he, that's kind of what they do for him when he comes out. Anyway. Oh, okay. Okay. But. Okay. After you provide a weapon to someone and they murder someone, do you think that the couth, couth, <laughs> do you think that's appropriate at that point? I, okay, so look, the optics are definitely effed up. I'll give you that. <laughs> I'll give you the optics are a little effed up, especially because a young lady did lose her life Right, that exactly, night. right, right. To a guy with, I don't know if it was fragile male masculinity at that point in Some- time. Or maybe she attacked him. I don't know the story behind it. Could have been a billion different I think things. it was more of a, like, assassination sort of thing. Yeah. Not, way, not quite that, but essentially, I like... I mean, uh, you, truth It wasn't a self-defense way. sort of thing, I think. Either way, somebody lost their life, so we got to take that with the reverence. Yeah, absolutely, yeah, So, yeah. the optics are a little effed up, but... The optics are definitely effed up. I do have to say is that it maybe would make a killer, uh, what do you call it, end zone celebration? Yeah, to be in Pat Town, like I mean, especially I guess you're if you're that guy. That, that, I mean, he, but it's a basketball. It would go viral. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, after okay. Well, yeah. They don't really have celebrations. In right. Basketball. So the only time they can do it is during introductions. Okay. Well, then that's the best time to do it. What yes. would be your end zone dance? <laughs> if you were a football player, like what? what would, like if you could do anything, what? do you have any idea what you would do as a celebration? Uh, mine would be okay. I don't know if you've ever played Destiny. Actually, I do know I've played it with yeah, you. Yeah, what the? F- yes, of course. I, I guess I was talking to the listener. Um, there is one Destiny emote where it's a it's a group emote, and three characters can sit on a couch and they can act like they're playing uh video games together, and then they can get up and like start doing. So you high would get fives. like two of your teammates to like stoop next. Yeah, to Yeah, we would just like sit. squat there and act like we're like, we'll just like kind of like move back and okay. forth like we're playing a racing game or something. Then we will all get up and like yeah, that would be my end zone celebration. Okay, okay. So have two have two people with me do it. Yeah, that would be fun. What do you think yours would be? Um, man. I would love to do the spiking over the goalpost, but I don't got hops. Spiking over the goalpost. Like you jump up and spike the ball. Tony well, Gonzalez used to do I that. I mean, we're also assuming that you're a professional football player, so I don't think you got oh, those skills well, then, either. Okay, if I have if I have like if I'm six six and have the hops of like an athlete. Sure, Jones. Um you can just I be would, me. Dude, part of me wants to do the leap, dude. I wanna jump in the crowd. You wanna jump into the I wanna crowd? do like the Lambo leap, dude. How like, far up do you wanna go? Just right into the front row. Oh, okay. I want so I want people I want people to like pour beer on me and slap my belly and like what? <laughs> oh no, I'm just being ignorant. 
But like, I feel like jumping up in the, or even just jump, just jumping up, not so like I turn around and land in them, but just jumping up where I jump up forward and they catch me and like almost like a hug. Oh, I think yeah. that would be like a cool, like the crowd, like dude, people love their football players. That's very So good. if you jump up and they're just like, I love you, oh, dude. Hey, why not just levitate into the sun? That could be your end zone. <laughs> Icar I can Icarus? Yeah, just like seriously, just just make the sign <laughs> of the cross. David Blaine. Make the sign of the cross. I want to see like the stigmata light up in your hands. My and, like, hands start bleeding exactly. from the center. That's stigmata. Yeah, exactly. You just raise up to the <laughs> these raise like, up. Uh, yeah. The halo music plays. Yeah. And as you rise up like lava and like tsunamis just take over the land below you and like everyone dies. Yeah, demons are coming up from the pits of hell. And Ooh. This is a good end zone. <laughs> Oompa Loompas? Sure. Sure. Why not? Put I little mean, orange guys down there. I would no, what I would probably do is I would probably <laughs> I would probably oh, do the hell. the riding the pony where like I like act like I have like one of them like ho stick horses and I like jump around because <laughs> I'm just an idiot, dude. I would just do something like super goofy and off the wall. I do like I do like the the idea that the NFL reinstated the uh, the uh, having fun policy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's good. I it's wish they let him have props. Like, like the guy who had the cell phone under the goalpost and pulled out the cell phone, or like To had the the sharpie in his in his sock and signed the football. Like I feel dude, like that's a slippery slope because it only takes a minute until somebody brings like a fake gun. The and syringe then like, and they like shoot what? up. <laughs> yeah, some, look, we're honestly, Jonas. Money does not mean necessarily intelligence. <laughs> we went over this. We talked about this a couple episodes <laughs> yeah. ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I feel like a lot of these football players have put a lot of their dedication into one area and not so much into the academic. Like being good at football and not being yeah. smart. Yes, and I just kind of you feel don't have to be smart mm. to be good at football. A quarterback does, but a lot of those other positions, it's like yeah. if you just gotta like notice a man and run and tackle a man, yeah. that doesn't take much intelligence. It takes a lot of athletic skill, yeah. but you don't have to be smart to do that. Yeah, I mean, and the intelligence could be used for you know, I got to make sure I eat properly. I know how many calories are in this. They don't know all of those numbers, but they aren't gonna like know. you could. They couldn't tell you like they how to like. Then they couldn't name off the first four presidents. This never is never. I Did don't you think, name off the four first. Absolutely not, Jonas. George Washington. No, we are not doing this. John, wait, we are not doing Quincy this. Adams. We are doing Thomas this, Jefferson. I don't even know if you're and right. And then is it John? Wait, how? how who's going to tell you if you're right? I'm, I'm the only one here up right now. I'm the only one wait, here, wait. and I don't know. Wait, I know Quincy Adams and John Quincy Adams. I don't, I don't know, know the order. No. They were dad and we, it's, son. It's already gone on for too long. No, dude. I want to know if I know this. It's I don't already, even know who the fifth president. It's where's, already where's, going on for too long. Where's uh, where's uh, Martin Fillmore? I don't know. I just know there's the nepotism, uh, the father-son duo. That's yeah, how long all right, here we go. That all was right, the first, got first issue Washington, of nepotism. John Adams, Jefferson. I got those. Oh, I miss Madison. James Madison is four. Mm. James Monroe is five. I then don't Quincy. Know. Don't even know who those people are. I've never heard any of those names. There are four fathers. <laughs> you thought you had one. You actually have four. <laughs> that was a dad joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what to do with you. I, I, don't, I don't know. It's Somehow fine. I paused the timer. This episode's probably over. <laughs> Man. It's about time to end. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Go to thecrazytown.com. Tell us if you know the five presidents. Jonas, T -T. we out.